Hello everyone, my name is Angelica and welcome to my channel. I hope you all are doing great and having lots of fun preparing for Christmas. But if you are a busy person and don't have that much time crafting for this Christmas, but you still want to have some really nice and unique decoration, this video is for you. Uh, I will be showing how to create three super easy and quick Christmas decoration. Uh, literally, you will need maximum half an hour for each project. I will be making no so Christmas stocking, a felt cutlery holder for your dining table, and a really big green Christmas star which you can hang on the wall. So, if you like my Christmas content and you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel. And for now, let's jump right into the first project. For this super easy decoration, I printed Christmas tree shape. I just found some template online, but you of course can draw it yourself. I made the tree tongue a bit wider, so two pieces of cutlery will easily fit on it. I will also use felt, I've got it in two different colors, white and green. One very Christmassy color and another one more minimalistic. I start with placing the template on my felt and using pen I'm tracing the Christmas tree shape. You can pin the template to the felt so it won't move but I just pressing it down and that's enough. I remove my template and using sharp scissors I cut the shape out. Then I mark two straight lines. I leave about one centimeter gap between them and cut them. This creates holes uh, where my cutlery are gonna go through. To decorate it, I'm using some small ruddy pom-poms. Uh, I chose red, which stands out well on the green and creates a lovely Christmassy theme. Then I done the same process with my white belt. And to decorate this one I'm using some small wooden ornaments, but of course you can use whatever you already have at home. So if you want your dining table look pretty this Christmas, this is a really good option. You can make different colors for each guest or make all the same in your favorite color. For my Christmas stocking, I'm using some fabric, which I bought in charity shop a while ago. I really like the color, so I knew one day I'm gonna make something out of it. It's also got nice texture and looks like linen, but of course you can use any kind and any color of fabric you like. I fold it in half and iron it a little bit to get rid of any creases. Using pencil, I draw shape of socking on my fabric. You can always use some template, but because it's quite easy shape, I just draw it like that. I want my stocking to have more organic look anyway, so I don't worry if the shape isn't perfect. Always remember to draw it a bit wider than you want it to be, I'm leaving some space for gluing. I draw my stocking super long at the top because I'm going to unwrap some of this fabric for the cuff. Then I cut this shape out. You can pin both parts of this fabric together or hold it strong enough so they won't move. You 
Using fabric glue, I'm going to attach both parts together. I'm putting the glue around the edges. Try to put it in the same distance from the edge all around. I do small parts at the time. Of course, don't glue the top part of the stocking together. Once the glue is dry and everything sticks together nicely, I turn it inside out. I unwrap the top part of my stocking, creating cuff. Then it's time to decorate it a little bit. I'm using snowflake shape stamp and black ink for the scarf. Pom-poms for the edge. I'm using ready pom-poms uh, as I want it to be quick project, but of course if you got more time you can make them yourself. Uh, I will link my video where I'm showing how to create own pom-poms so you can go and check it out as well. And I also add some fresh details. I absolutely love how this tree smells like. And of course, we have to hang it somehow, so using the same fabric, I'm making a loop which I glue to the back of my stocking. So if you don't have sewing machine, this easy stocking uh, project is perfect. You can also use hot glue instead of fabric glue and remove the fresh leaves once you decide to put your Christmas decoration away. And if it's got dirty, hand wash will be the best option. To create my star, I'm using 24 wooden craft lolly sticks. Mine are quite white, but the ordinary shape ones will work as good. I start with placing them in the star shape. Once I'm happy with that, I start gluing them together using hot glue. There isn't any right way to do it, just glue one and on the top on the other stick and one end under the other stick, if that makes sense. This way the star construction becomes more stronger. Once everything is glued together, I'm going to add some fresh leaves from any conifers. I cut small section of them and then again using hot glue I attach them to my star. When my star is fully covered, I add some twine to be able to hang it on later. It's probably one season decoration as leaves will dry and won't look that great anymore, but it was super easy and quick to do. 
And I know I've sat down ready, but I love the fresh smell it gives. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and this project. If you did, please click the like button. I will really appreciate it. And also let me know in the comment section if you have put your Christmas tree up already. I've seen that many people already have. Uh, and I remember back home, we used to put our Christmas tree up quite late, sometimes even on 24th of December. Uh, but then was like standing up to middle of january but of course everyone's got different traditions so i want to hear what's yours when you usually put your christmas tree up and for now thank you so much for watching and your support and i will see you in my next video